as I'm sitting here getting ready for a tournament tonight, I've had people tell me I may have a little bit, just, just, just a little bit of a problem. I might have a little bit of an addiction. <laughs> oh, it ain't over yet. Y'all just keep watching. Y'all come on with me. We'll do a little bit of a tour. Now, this ain't all my stuff. Me and my dad going together on everything. And my buddy Remington, his stuff's here. Big John's stuff's here. But fishing bench. We got molds. We got the lead melter. All the spinner baits that dad makes. I ain't, I ain't taking the time to do it because I'm not patient enough. But he makes a bunch of spinner baits. And if y'all are interested in the spinner baits, uh, just leave a comment and I'll get back to you on it and we'll get it set up for you. He makes them. I don't know the exact prices, <clears throat> but you, I will give you contact information if you're interested and he, I will get them to y'all. But, uh, let's take a look here. Y'all want to see what not knowing what to do tonight looks like. Let's take a look at what's on the front deck of the boat. Look here. We got a jig. We got spinner bait. We got a crank bait. And then come over here, move the hook box, lift the rod locker. We got two spinning rods with a brush hog and one big worm on a spinning rod. Don't sound like a good idea, it probably ain't, but that's what I set up. Uh, got, you know, about 2,642 baits in the boat, a bunch of boxes, boat's a mess. Uh, got, a, got the front seat out here in the middle of the boat. Got to clean out a bunch of bottles and stuff. But yeah, we got everything tied on from jigs to cranking. And the only thing I ain't got on up there is a, I don't even know. I ain't got no top water because the water's about 85 degrees. But I'll get out there and probably wish I had one. <laughs> uh, been tough lately. The fish, the fish is just now starting to get a little bit better on center hill. The water's kind of come down a little bit. You're not fishing in solely just straight bushes all the time, which was awesome in the spring, you know, when you're flipping bushes. That was cool. I enjoyed it. I had a lot of fun. When I fished the volunteer bass open, got in the top 20 by flipping bushes. Now I can flip bushes and all I do is lose jigs <laughs> and worms and throwing crankbaits. Ain't no telling how many crankbaits I've lost in the last two weeks. I mean, it seems like you make three cranks with them. You're like, oh God, that's a good, oh, nope, that's a bush. But, and this is what I already cleaned out of the boat. This was on the dash. Welcome to a day in the life of a fisherman. Uh, I can't fit everything in the boat. There's a bunch of the zoom bait, slider baits, uh, cabin creek baits, big sow hard or soft plastics, dragon series man's baits, the baits 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 and more baits and sometimes i can't put five fish in the flipping boat but uh that's just how it goes uh i'd like to tell you i'm a real good fisherman but really i'm just a guy that runs down the lake and flips in a bunch of spots and hopes to get three to five bites <laughs> i have caught some great fish i've win nights where i didn't have a limit but it's fishing keep a smile on your face y'all just stay tuned with us i haven't been able to do any tournament videos because right now the fishing's at night and i really don't know what camera i can take at night and trying to get the lighting and everything it's, it'd just be a big mess and y'all wouldn't enjoy the quality anyway but i figured i'd give y'all a little bit of a look to the chaos in my life of every day to day so uh y'all stay tuned with us deer season's coming up it just seems like it's a long way off but it ain't we got the velvet hunt at the end of august and we're going to spider some leaves with some blood, son. So y'all just keep in, keep in tune with us. I'm going to do everything I can to get more videos put out for y'all. I'll try to do a shooting video this week. 
maybe some fireworks videos for the fourth who knows I, I might try to go fishing one day during the day a little tough during the day right now but we'll see if we can get that done y'all just stay tuned with us i know i haven't made a video in a while and i apologize I'm trying to get everything set up we got the buck scent pads to do this year i'm collaborating with them trying to get everything set up for that so we can get y'all some footage of some deer and how great this product really is so just hang in there with us we'll do everything we can skfl baby y'all stay tuned